Jimmy, is it on? Oh, no, but I got to fix it. Hold on. You good? Hold on. Okay, put it, put it in the clip. No, the other way. Sorry? Yeah. No, no. You had it. There. There you go. Okay, ready? All right. And now the end is near. And so I face the final curtain. My friend, I'll say it clear. I'll state my case. Which I'm certain I've lived a life that's full I've traveled each and every highway And more, much more than this I did it my way Regrets, I've had a few But then again too few to mention I did what I had to do I saw it through without exemption I planned each charted course each careful step along the byway and more so much more than this I did it my way Yes, there were times I'm sure you knew When I bit off more than I could chew But through it all When there was doubt Well, I ate it up And I spit it out I faced it all And I stood tall And I did it my way I've loved, I've laughed, I've cried I've had my fill, my share of losing And now the tears subside And I find it all so amusing To think we did all that and may I say, not in a shy way Oh no, 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 not Matt He did it my way For what is a man, what has he got If not himself, for he has not To say the things he truly feels and not the words of one who kneels The record shows I took the blows And I did it my way Just so you know The record shows that I did it my way Bit of the chairman of the board going on there, right, Jimmy? He did it, Yori, buddy. He started it 12 weeks ago. That's right. We did it our way, my friend. We did, and we had a little throwback to the, the first days of the cell phone. I'm right? not sure people got that, I hope, because remember the old iPhone with the shaky yes. and the cutoff? And yeah. I'm, are you on? Are you on? Are we on? Oh. Are we on? <laughs> <laughs> I don't think we actually had that happen, right? The first oh, yes. time when it went yeah. off, and we're sitting here. Are we on? Are, are we, we on? live? Are we on? Luckily, we didn't say anything bad. <laughs> it's true, because <laughs> normally we would have. Crazy. So listen, so, this is our swan song, Jeff. This is our last, our last one. It's the last one. Here at Cunningham's Pub. Yep, at we're, this location, At this right? location. We're yeah. opening next the next Tuesday, so unfortunately, you know, these Fridays, I just want to tell you these Fridays, what people have been written in, and what it means to people around the world, my friend. A couple things, like uh, Carrie, Ginn, Carrie Ginn came the other day on Wednesday right. uh, from Ingleside. He lives out in uh, towards Cornwall area. That's right, yeah. And he drove all the way down here, gave us a special note. Uh, gave us a little package, uh, little package, and he, what it means to him and his family to sit around and watch. And his wife Terry's going through a, she got some other bad news, a little bit of bad news about cancer, but she's out there, she's watching tonight, and we just wish her the best of luck and health. You know what I mean? Uh, but uh, these people, what they're saying is unbelievable what it means to them. So Jeff, thank you, brother. Like I always said, thank you for what you're doing on Friday nights. It means a lot to people around the world. You know, it was funny because we've said it before. It started for a one-off yeah. because we wanted to, to launch your takeout business. That's right, <laughs> exactly, exactly, yeah. Boy, I guess we did a good takeout did a great business. Job. Great job, unbelievable, yeah. <laughs>
Look at your buddy Mike Brooks from California too, Mike Brooks. So tonight, I don't know if everybody knows, but tonight we're doing uh, we're doing a tip jar today, right? I, 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 I surprised we, you yes, guys. Uh, I surprised you guys last week. I said I want to collect some money. We've collected over eighteen thousand dollars for charity so far. Yes. And tonight it's about you, Matt, and I. So we're doing a tip jar. So people could go to our website, uh, CunninghamsPub.com, or our Facebook page and right. hit the order food right now, and you'll see that there's a chip dar, tip dar for you guys. Okay. For your buddy Mike Brooks, California, sent in, you know, quite a bit of money Mike from Brooks, California. I, I think he's out. No, he's out in. Uh, he's at uh, in Ontario in Barrie. No, Mike Brooks. I, I, was it? Is it Barry? Yeah. Well, Maybe I know two Mike Brooks, but I think the one you're talking about lives out in Barry. Okay, could be. I'm sorry about yeah. that. I got to go. Well, someone else from California sent in some money That's too. That's one of my so. ex-girlfriends who lives out there in California. Ah, <laughs> nice, nice. <laughs> we were just talking about that. Nice. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's right. And so we're going to recap yeah. uh, this week. Uh, uh, this week. Yeah, this week. We're going to do, um, I think I mentioned last week, that songs that were either A, the most requested, B had the biggest response, or C that I liked the best. Yeah. So don't panic. Don't send your cards and letters in. I will not be doing the entire Rick Springfield catalog <laughs> today. <laughs> but there will be one. There, uh, you never know, never Jimmy. Know. Did you, you take know. a peek at the set list? <laughs> so uh, one of the ones we did uh, a, a couple of shows ago, we ha I did one of my son's songs. Yeah. Uh, he became a musician, and he's a pretty pretty good one too. And. Uh, he got a lot of responses. A lot of uh, girls wrote in and said, "Gee, what a good-looking kid!" And of course, it was the Bob syndromes, uh, the whole Bob Smith syndrome again. Forget about me. Yeah. Now it's about Luther. Luther. <laughs> right. So when Luther was a boy, I mean, a real little boy, I he was born, and I wrote this tune. I guess all fathers go through this kind of, you know, uh, insecurity when they have a, a son or a daughter, of course. Or, they come in, in kits, and you can have either one or the other, or two. <laughs> or two. Yeah, Never two know. of each, one or of each. one of each. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Okay. So this one is called Sad Reminder. Great song. Great song. My dad was a busy man, as far as I could tell. Keeping away the bad guys, those monsters in the hall. And I can still see his muddy shoes. After spring rains came down It's a mighty rush of memories So deep you'd think I'd drown But tonight a child remembers The man who let him down I'm the son of a son And I don't want to sound cliched But now I'm a father and now I'm afraid Cause when I look at you Yeah, I'm sure I can see What my dad must have seen When he looked at me And tonight I remember The man who let me down And from a father to son so much could get lost And when I'm far away Are we paying that cost? From this musty old hotel Of no particular renown I'm suffering from inattention From some unnoticed town Am I just a sad reminder Of the man Who let me down Here in the distance, a faint skidding sound But well, that's the brakes on my memory, trying to slow down And I'm taking a trip down memory lane And I'm finding out sometimes that street's paved with pain So Luther, my boy you're still stumbling around But better each day At arranging your sounds If there's only one thing You could learn from me now And when finally you're grown If you remember somehow Just don't be a sad reminder Of the man you down
Jeff, you do the covers and stuff, fantastic, but to hear you sing one of your originals, you could just tell the passion you have, my friend. That was fantastic. Oh, thank you, Jim. Fantastic. Yeah, that was thank off you. my first record, as a matter of fact. Wow. Six records ago. Well, a friend of yours actually dropped off two cassettes and some homemade cookies last week. <laughs> Christy. Yeah, Christy, that's right. So two cassettes. So I got to try and find my Walkman downstairs somewhere because <laughs> <laughs> I can't find a cassette player. Do you know that uh, my records have been available on LP cassettes? <laughs> Eight track stereo? No. Isn't that a Jackson Brown song? No, no, no. no. <laughs> That's the only media they weren't available on. Okay, there you go. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. So listen, guys, a trick we had this week. We, it's kind of a joke. Me and Jeff sat down last week. So let's do, let's let's design a T-shirt. Remember, we sat okay. down about ten days ago. We sat down. That's right. And the first one was a Bob Smith T-shirt, just because we love Bob Smith, right? Oh yeah. Well, Bob is that's our guy. Yeah. yeah so we just want to say, guy. if you guys go online to the app, right? I don't know if we'll show the pictures now. It's a little bit later, but. Just to go on our app online, the ordering app, or if you guys want to leave a tip there too, you can order some t-shirts. We just, we made up some funny t-shirts, but they're actually real. <laughs> well, no, wait, wait, yeah, wait a minute, hang on a second. The one with my face on it is not funny, Jim. Well, it's a serious That is garment. a serious one, that is a serious you one. Know, if you want to be yeah. in the haute couture, you know, <laughs> top of the fashion line, that's the one you buy. If you want to be sensible, you buy any of the other ones. Other ones, you know? yeah. Yeah, yeah. And if you look over Jeff's shoulder, we see when we do some shots over there, there's a, a beautiful black poster that we have uh, out for anybody who donates or, or tips more than $100 tonight. So you get a, a signed poster of Jeff and uh, signed look, by Matt and Oz and Jeff. And as you look, see there? Oh, there, there, there it is. is. Matt, yeah. you got it. Now, look yeah. at that. Look, look I, wait, hang on. There you go. Look down. I look, look just down. like the guy. Look down. It's the same, right? <laughs> no. Beautiful. So this next song, you, you sang this and it was one of my favorite. Yeah, I think this was in show number five. Yeah, one of my favorite and the remarks we got and the uh, response from the crowd was fantastic. Here we go. Yeah. Don Henley, The End of the Innocence. by man 
We sit and watch the clouds roll by The tall grass waves in the wind And you can lay your head back on the ground Let your hair spill all around you Offer up your best defense This is the end This is the end of the innocence I love that song. Jeff, we got yeah. a special guest tonight. We do. Yes. Your next song, your next song, I want to tie it in a little bit. Your next song is for Marty Silverstone, right? Yes. The, rodeo. the king of St. Anne's. The king Anne's. of Kensington, king yeah. of St. Anne's. And now we have kind of the queen, the mayor of St. Anne's. We who's do. Here tonight, who's been a huge supporter. Paula's here today. She's a huge supporter of the show. She has been, uh, yes. And it's always written in, it's always uh, donated to the charities and stuff. And I just want to say, Paula, welcome to the show live. Well, thank you. What, a, what an honor and a privilege, really, to be here tonight and to hear you live. and. Uh, can I just take a second to thank both of you? You know, a few weeks ago, when all of this started, a few weeks ago, seems like forever yeah. now, but I think everybody was down and, and things seemed dark. And uh, for you guys just came up on a Friday night and all of a sudden uh, there was hope and there was something to look forward to every single Friday night. And I can't tell you how invaluable that is to, uh, to all of us. So thank you, both of you, to uh, Jeff, you've got a tremendous talent, and Jim, you are just an incredible community person, thank and thank you so much for, for everything. Really, you've, uh, you gave us hope through all those dark times, and now it's, uh, the sun is back out, yep. and uh, we're coming back to halfway normalcy, and... Uh, you know what's great, too, is that how the, rest, how the rest, thank you, Paul, that's so nice, but how the rest of the CNN's crew kicked in, Dan Bouguera, Dan Bouguera is St. Anne's resident with the doing pictures and, and stuff. Marty Silverstone. Marty Silverstone coming in, you know, together. Um, uh, if she's a name from the food bank. Um, uh, Giselle. Giselle, Giselle from the food bank. Yeah. Unbelievable. You know, Julie Barbeau from yeah. St. Anne's wrote an incredible article the other day. Uh, Kevin Woodhouse yeah. from Suburban. All these St. Anne's people who really yeah. rallied around us and yep. made it special, you know. I'm, I'm very happy with that. Yeah. St. Anne's is a special place. Yeah. It's a very special place. It sure is. And we're glad to have you here, uh, Madam Mayor. Well, thank and you. I, I want to I wanna <laughs> tell you that We've, in, over the course of the 12 weeks, we've created certain characters on the show, and you have been one of them. I've referred to you several times, but I, I never told anybody the, the, the best story. It's, and it, No, you won't get in trouble, I promise. <laughs> we were on the phone one day talking, uh, the mayor and I, because I get to hobnob with the bigwigs <laughs> in town, now with the fame coming with this gig. And uh, I said, yeah, we, we, we have a new uh, setup. We have Matt and, and Oz coming in. And she said, well, what's Matt and Oz? And I suspect, I, I expected everybody to know what Matt and Oz is. <laughs> of course, they don't. So I said, yeah, Matt and Oz are coming in. But there's a new light in that the town security will see glowing out the window. Yeah. And this is before we had mastered blacking out the windows behind us. So Jim and I were really nervous. And I 